And our state is still firmly in the red zone for a third straight week as COVID cases rise. The latest White House Coronavirus Task Force report warning Georgia is in the early stages of full resurgence. We have team coverage of the latest developments, including Liza Lucas on a rare illness seen in young children caused by COVID. Christy Diaz with a closer look at the White House report. But first, Mara Sirianni live at the state capitol with Governor Kemp's message about COVID in our state. Well, Sheba, Governor Kemp says he understands that people want to be together. That's only natural on the holidays, but he also says that this year we need to look out for one another and maybe reassess and think twice about going around those family members who are at a higher risk of contracting COVID. So Governor Kemp and uh, Department of Public Health Commissioner Dr. Kathleen Toomey reemphasizing four main points. Wear a mask, socially distance, wash your hands, and follow the executive order. Toomey said every time a holiday approaches, the state sees COVID numbers spike. She warned residents not to use a negative COVID test as a justification to ignore those guidelines. Here's what Governor Kemp says about gatherings and travel. If possible, consider gathering virtually or limiting your holiday gatherings to only a few people within the same household. If you're traveling, take extra steps to socially distance from those you don't regularly see. And Governor Kemp says he does not expect to impose any additional uh, guidelines or any additions to that executive order that's already in place. And state health officials are also urging you to go ahead and get that flu shot.